So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to properly get double movement using two free softwares called Tease2x Input and also one GitHub link that I don't necessarily know the name of. However, I will say that this is a free software that doesn't have viruses and you guys can very easily get fully functioning double movement in Fortnite, especially if you're on keyboard and mouse. Basically, it's going to trick your keyboard into thinking that you're using an analog stick and it's going to basically give you the proper double movement that keyboards like the Wooting one will have. So if you guys do enjoy the video, please consider using code SonataYT in the Fortnite item shop to support me and let's hop into this video. So now I'm going to be showing you guys exactly how to install these two softwares that you guys will need in order to get the proper double movement. We're going to start off with this GitHub link. This is basically going to be a software that makes your keyboard think that it's using a controller and and it's going to give you that 360 degree movement that you guys want. <laughs> And then the second software is going to be this keys 2x input software. This is what's going to let you control all of the various different, you know, type of settings that you want, how much you want to be able to move to the right and to the left. And this is basically going to control the intensity of your double movement. So we're going to start off by installing this GitHub link. You guys are going to start at the top of the page and then scroll all the way down and click on this 64 MSI dot link. I'm going to click on this and it's going to start installing down here as you guys can see. And before clicking on that, I'm going to in, uh, install this one as well. I'm going to go ahead and click download on this link and it's going to start downloading 56 kilobytes so not very much and then it's going to be installed right there so what i'm going to do next is i'm going to minimize this and i'm going to pull up my downloads tab as you guys can see both of them are right here and what i'm going to start by doing is i'm going to right click on this little you know icon that's right there and click install and it's going to say we're preparing to install and then i'm going to click i accept the terms in the license agreement i'm going to click install next and then it's going to start installing and a little th message is going to pop up on my screen that's why my screen just went black because this little message talking about do you want do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device just pop up i'm gonna click yes and then it's gonna come back and as you guys can see we have this you know various like it just started with this finish screen i'm gonna click finish and that's done installing so after that's done installing we don't really need to do anything of you know particular use with that so what we're gonna do after that is we're gonna go into keys 2x input and we're gonna click open and as you guys can see this is right here and we want to try to get this out of the you know the zip file so what we're going to do is we're going to go back to downloads right click on this click extract all and i'm going to go to the download section of my computer i'm going to click extract and it's going to extract right here so right here we this zip file isn't of use anymore so we don't really need to worry about this we're just going to go into this readme and i'm going to explain what it's telling us here right here this is basically telling us all the settings and all the steps that we're going to need to use i'm not going to read this because i'm going to be telling you exactly what to do after this so i'm going to close this right here and then i'm going to see this keys 2x input software I'm gonna right click on it click run as administrator and something is going to pop on my screen saying Windows protected your PC Micro, uh, Microsoft Defender smart screen prevented an unrecognized app from starting running this app might put your PC at risk However, after extensive research, I can tell you guys this app will not harm your PC PC So you're gonna click more info and click run anyway And it's gonna start up the app as you guys can see It's also gonna ask me for an administrator thing So I'm gonna click yes on this my screen is gonna come back to normal and as you guys can see we have the keys to X input right here So I'm going to minimize my files and as you guys can see we have the keys 2x input right here i'm going to be showing you guys the best settings for proper double movement at least in my opinion what is the best double movement you guys can potentially get so what i'm going to start with is this strafe setting you guys are going to do this and you're going to turn it down to 2000 for your strafe setting then continuing after that you guys are going to try to turn your diagonal up all the way down to 15,000, which is going to be a very medium setting and very good for you then diagonal down and you're going to turn down to 23 thousand and this is basically going to give you the type of double movement that you want it's not going to be too strong to the point where you're falling off builds regularly but it's also going to be quite strong to the point where you guys can properly use it to evade you know shots or rotate with it or whatever basically so i'm gonna, then going to click save configuration it's going to click ok and as you guys can see there's block keys which is the keys that like you know it'll block um you know your wasd when you're typing and then there's also the key bind saying alt zero so if you guys want to click alt zero it'll turn it off and then it'll also turn it on it enable equals alt zero so what you guys are going to want to do definitely is you're going to want to get used to clicking alt zero which is the you know on and off switch and then block keys if you guys want to be typing something that you're going to want to turn it off so i'm going to click save configuration once again click ok and now we're going to load up fortnite and test it all right, so as you guys can see, we are now in a free building world. I'm just gonna be showing you guys exactly how this double movement works. So right now I'm clicking W and D, and this is the exact angle that it's moving me at. This is the type of double movement that I enjoy. It's not too strong, but it's also not too weak. It's, it's to the point where you can still do this with ease. And it kind of reminds me of those double movement finds, which I loved so much when they were in the game. Sorry for the bad quality, by the way, my PC is still not very good. But as you guys can see, this is the double the, the type of double movement that I enjoy. This is what's gonna give you uh, what you're gonna get from those settings that I described earlier. And as you guys can see, this is kind of me cranking with it. It does take a little bit to get used to, as you guys can see. So, um, you know, it just takes a little bit of, you know, practice to get used to. You have to be able to properly do this, um, in terms of, like, you know, in-game and whatnot. 
and obviously when you're moving sideways you can do some like retakes or whatever however you know due to my keybinds it's a little bit more difficult for me um, but basically this is how the double movement works in game as you guys can see you basically just move sideways at a speed um, where you can essentially you know just build a floor like this as you guys can see without you know kind of you know having to like look this way repeatedly which is different from the normal so like I was saying basically this is the way that it works if you guys want to try to move sideways and this is basically the way that the double movement works and as you guys want as you guys can obviously see um, and this is how you guys are going to be able to properly move when you do eventually, you know, uh, install it properly, like I said before. So yeah, let's move on to the next section of the video. Alright guys, that is the video on exactly how to get double movement using two free softwares. If you guys enjoyed, please consider dropping a like and subscribing to the channel down below. If this video did help you out, please consider leaving a comment letting me know so that I can know exactly what you guys think. But that's about it for this video guys, be sure to like and subscribe to the channel and I will see you all in the next video. Bye guys.